We have a big, big announcement this morning, London's Lights event at the Lights is happening soon and today to share some of the details we have Andrea Solberg and Mary Ann Ellen Rolfson with the Landon's Light Foundation here to tell us a little bit more about what you guys have planned. You guys are always doing great things. We love sharing your stories but first before we get to the big announcement you gotta wait. Uh, we want to talk a little bit about Landon and Landon's Light Foundation. Andrea can you talk a little bit about what you guys do? Sure. Landon Slate Foundation was created in honor of my son that was diagnosed with a terminal brain tumor in 2017 at the age of 10. He fought a very courageous battle and passed away in September of 2019. His time here on earth was cut short, but his maturity was well beyond his years. Just in the way he lived his life with such purpose and connection and kindness for others. And now we're able to take that legacy in and carry that on through the Landon's Light Foundation. So a little bit about our mission is that we support children that are battling serious medical conditions just to provide a moment of, of pure joy and hope to them during their difficult journey. And then beside that, we help children um, throughout the community grow in their faith, their academics, and their physical well-being because those were components that were really important to Landon. I know he would be proud of everything you're doing. Just an incredible amount of good things you've done in just a short amount of time. And uh, Mary Ellen, we want you to talk about the next big event. And this is a big one, okay? You're just sharing uh, the announcement right now. What's happening? We are. We're really excited to announce an annual event presented by Landon's Light Foundation called Landon's Night at the Lights. So this will be an annual event held at the Essentia Health Plaza at the Lights. This year's event is really going to be an inspirational evening to honor Landon and then highlight the work that the foundation is doing in our community. Um, so we're looking forward to um, bringing inspirational speakers together and our featured guest is actually Carson Wentz. Okay, that is a big name. I love that. Yes. And so I'm, you didn't have to twist his arm because Carson and Landon had a bond. They did. We're really fortunate that it worked out for, for Carson Wentz. Obviously, he's a very busy individual. Um, he had a really strong connection with Landon and a really special bond. They met at the AO1 Foundation's camp, and Landon attended that for two years in a row. He also was able to throw out the first pitch at Landon's softball game in Philadelphia, and then the Solberg family and Landon attended one of his football games. So just a great bond. We're really looking forward to having him there, bringing him in back to the community for our event. We're also excited to add um, David Richmond, who is the NDSU men's basketball coach, as well as Matt Entz that evening, um, who is the NDSU football coach. So bringing three incredible individuals together on the same night, it's going to be wonderful. And I, I think the inspirational conversation part of this is just what all of us really need and want right now. Um, how did you come up with that idea? We really wanted this first annual event to be um, and honor the work we're doing as a foundation. And so it will be a, a fun and inspirational night bringing us together outside at a beautiful venue. We'll have um, some fun live music. Um, we'll have food trucks and concessions and then we'll have some kid-based activities too. Yeah, family friendly for sure. Andrea, can you touch a little bit on the, the, the perfect pairing of the Landon's Light Foundation and the lights in West Fargo? Sure. You know, I can't help but think that Landon has a hand in all of this because I can remember when this venue was first being built and Travis and I were driving down Cheyenne and we saw the light sign up on the building and I looked over at Travis and I said, someday we're going to have a Landon's Light Foundation event at the lights. So we feel really fortunate and blessed to have had this connection and now moving forward there is going to be a special permanent tribute at the lights that will be unveiled at the event which of course makes this venue even more uh, near and dear to our hearts really is the hot spot right now and i know i've i've thought about this in the past too i, I love to go to the lights uh, but a lot of kids landon's age go my daughter who is the same age as landon they they like to go to the lights. so it's just it, it really is the perfect place you know to always remember Landon as well because I know he would have loved to have been riding his bike over there and hanging out with his friends. And we're excited moving forward this is going to be an annual event uh, every year it will look a little bit different but it will be surrounded around the time frame of his birthday so we'll just have a celebration and we love the connection um, that we have built. You guys are doing great things okay so tell us again the date um, how do we get tickets and uh, I mean you already mentioned it's even in addition to the speakers, great family fun night. 
Right. So the event is June 27th, Sunday evening. Um, so plenty of time to come back from the lake and still attend the event. You can get tickets today. They go on sale at 10 a.m. at Ticketmaster. Uh, follow along on our social channels. We'll be sharing information there as well as the ticket link. You can go to our website at landonslight.org. We'll have a link there and more information about the event as well. And we'll make sure all of that gets up on our North Dakota Today Facebook page as well because you guys are doing great, great things. This is a big, big announcement, uh, but you guys have things going on all year round, golf tournaments and, you know, basketball tournaments and uh, miracle moments and, you know, I, I could go on and on. So thank you so <laughs> much for sharing this and yes. uh, I'm looking forward to the event as well. Thank, thank you, you for guys. having us. Thank you. Stay with us. Coming up next, May is National Mental Health Awareness Month, and we are talking to Beyond Boundaries about the help that they provide to those individuals who need it.